All right, this is Coach Steve Reynolds from South Bend, Washington High School. I'm also a scout with Lady Baller Insider. Just taking a look at our 2022 uh, Mila Reynolds, just breaking down some film and looking at some things she's done well over time. So let's go ahead and get started. Um, right here, you see her getting behind the defense, um, which is really important when you're trying to beat a press. Gets her eyes up right away on the catch, freezes the defender, makes her make a decision. So when she catches, because she looks, she forces the defender to go out to the shooter, creating some space so she can get to that pull-up jumper, uh, which has become a staple of hers. Uh, really wanted to help her understand that scoring has to be at all three levels, and uh, she has to have that mid-range. Uh, right here, she's already getting out one step ahead of everybody else, looks back over her shoulder, make eye contact with your passer. Uh, a lot of times you got to have that uh, make eye contact so your passer knows that you want it. Uh, one thing that's important too, we always teach our kids to go backboard net. You'd be surprised. A lot of kids intentionally use the backboard, front of the rim, then they want it to go in from there, but you can't trust the rim. Some rims are tight or just different depending on where you're at. On this play, we see Mila looking up, surveying the floor, seeing her options. She decides to look and lean to get her defender to go with her and delivers the pass high right on the money where her big can finish. Another thing that's important is that she drags the defenders with her, creating space that gives our big here enough time to finish. At 6'2", uh, if you can push it and create like she does, it's a huge plus. But right here, you see her doing what we call taking a snapshot. Um, she's looking at both of her teammates who are running wide in their lanes, which allows her to make a decision on what she wants to do. So here, you'll see as she gets out, she takes that snapshot and she turns her defender, forcing her to stop the ball drawing two defenders while with her eyes looking at a shooter on the wing, but knowing that she's going to her teammate who's on the block for an easy layup. Again, versatility is the name of the game. So we got her here on the block, nice wide stance. I like that she looks over her shoulder as the ball is coming. So we talk about getting in the space before you attempt your shot. So here she gets into the space and uses her offhand softly all net. Here she gets wide again, comes in hard, looks over her shoulder, sets her up with the dribble and the lean, and she turns. But I, I really, I don't like her um, base right here because she'll get bumped off of that shot at the next level. Uh, but she's able to gather herself and finish after setting her up to the middle and drop stepping baseline. It's a nice move. Um, here she's on the block right next to her defender. Again, this is really about versatility. Um, knowing her skill set, uh, as Shonda Jones attacks, she gets to an open space, comes to the ball even a little bit. Uh, maybe that's the difference between her getting that shot off and not getting it off. Um, right here, she's flashing. On um, this play, we want to draw this top man out, flash behind her. So what you'll see is as she catches, she'll get her eyes on the rim right away. And uh, that puts a lot of pressure on the defender uh, to have to make a decision. So here she shot fakes, one dribble, gets on two feet, and finishes with that floater. Again, eyes on the rim, and uh, she gets to this open space again uh, where she can finish with touch over the front of the rim. It's a really nice play. Um, on this one, uh, on the ball reversal, again, she's just moving. Uh, we've dragged the defense um, over and she's coming behind the defense, creating space on the skip pass. I love threes off the skip pass. And uh, right here, she's able to line it up, uh, do her work with her feet before the ball or as the ball is getting there. And so that she can have plenty of time to shoot and hold her follow through. Um, here, this is one of my favorite moves. Again, it's a dribble jab, uh, putting the ball down with the left, giving the appearance she's going right. So what you'll see here is, the game of basketball is all about leverage. You know, Mila's shoulders are lower than her defenders on her drive. 
sometimes it doesn't matter how fast or quick you are. If you win that battle, you can get to the spots that you want to get to. And so here you see her getting to that spot uh, and then getting to that open space so that she can shoot the pull up again over the top. So um, hopefully this was helpful uh, to some of you players who are out there who are 6'2", 6'3", and you want to play on the perimeter, um, but don't neglect that you know you need to be able to score at all three levels. So being able to score with your back to the basket, mid-range, or from the perimeter um, is special. And um, here we see Mila doing those things, uh, really showing her skill set. So like many of you, we'll go back to the lab and uh, try to keep improving. God bless.